and we are now just two days away from the beginning of a history making criminal case here in Fulton County Two of former President Donald Trump's 18 co defendants will be in court Friday as jury selection begins in their criminal trial. They are accused of taking part in a criminal conspiracy to overturn the 2020 election. 11 Live's Jerry Carnes has been following the case. He has more. It begins with two. On Friday, 450 people will be called to a Fulton County courtroom, all of them potential jurors in a history making case. On trial, lawyers Kenneth Chesborough and Sidney Powell, two of the people charged along with former President Donald Trump, of taking part in a criminal conspiracy to overturn the 2020 election. Just days before the start of jury selection, Judge Scott McAfee ruled that Chesborough and Powell failed to prove a defect in their criminal indictments and denied their attempts to have the cases against them dismissed. Chesborough is accused of taking part in the so-called fake elector scheme, where 16 people signed documents at the Georgia State Capitol falsely claiming that Donald Trump won the vote in Georgia and that they should represent the state at the Electoral College. Powell is accused of taking part in a data breach at the Coffee County Election Office while working on behalf of former President Trump. Powell and Chesborough deny that they were part of a conspiracy and in court filings told Judge McAfee that the charges against them should be dismissed in part because their actions on behalf of Donald Trump were not for personal gain. Potential jurors will complete questionnaires on Friday. Lawyers will begin the process of questioning and selecting 12 jurors next Monday. All right, so here's what's going to take place next. If lawyers can't select 12 suitable jurors out of the initial group of 450, another 450 people will be called next Friday. Judge McAfee says his goal is to have a jury sworn in before November 3rd.